Welcome to the first Conversations video of 2021. <clears throat> Took a little short break over Christmas and New Year's and boy, did I need it. I'm sure everybody needed it, but we are back with a vengeance. And so uh, uh, we'll start up again and do this uh, every week through the end of the school year at least. Yesterday, I went up to um, Snooper's Rock, which is uh, in the Prentice Cooper Wildlife Refuge. I think it's just over the line into Georgia. I know it's just over the line into central time zone. And it's just a little outcrop of rock that uh, was used during the Civil War to uh, look for troop movements in the valley down below by the river. But it is a gorgeous, gorgeous place. And I love going there. So I went yesterday. I went on Saturday. I'm recording this on Sunday. I went on Saturday. It was cold. It was about 28 degrees. And I took uh, the EOSR camera that I'm recording on here, and I took my little Canon M50, and I thought, I've got so much stuff to carry, um, I, I'm not going to carry my phone. Um, <clears throat> and that would, turned out to be a huge mistake, because when I got down there, uh, my Canon M50 evidently did not handle the weather, and it stopped working. And so while I was able to take pictures for the video that I was making, I wasn't able to make any B-roll. I wasn't able to do any video of me taking pictures or video of the people around me, you know, because I had my camera set up and had it stabilized. And so I thought, I will go back today. Um, maybe it won't be so cloudy and overcast. Maybe I'll have a better sunrise <clears throat> and uh, I'll be prepared. Everything will work just fine. And got up there today. And again, the equipment I had for B-roll all that little behind the scenes stuff did not work. Two days of driving an hour to Snooper's Rock, spending a couple or three hours there doing pictures, and then an hour back. And after two days, I still didn't get what I want because the technology just didn't work. And I thought driving back today, it's just a little small, small inkling of what teachers have gone through this last semester and what you're going to go through this semester when you come to work and you've got your day mapped out and you've got your lesson plans in place and you've got the videos you're going to show and the online tools you're going to use and then the internet goes down or Aspen stops working or Canvas is not working or any other of a number of things that just really, really chap your cheeks for the day. And that's what happened to me the last two days up on Snooper's Rock. So luckily for me in 2021, I have made a commitment to try to bring joy back to my soul. And I've done that in a couple of ways. I left Twitter, I left Facebook, not necessarily for political reasons or because they're censoring people or because it's a bad thing, but because I was addicted. I was just addicted. I was on it all the time. And when I'm on it, I'm looking. Did somebody comment? Is there somebody in my comment thread who's in a fight? Is there, do I have to intervene somewhere? Do I have to worry about what my relatives are saying? <laughs> you know, all these things uh, just brought this angst every single day. And so I just quit. I said, you know what? I'm not going there. I'm not doing that. It's over. I'm seeking joy. So today, when my camera didn't work and my B-roll wasn't going to happen, and I'm looking at either a really, really sorry video or going back a third time and trying again, which is what I may do next week, I just sat down by a little creek bed and listened to the water run. Listened to it babble over rocks, that little noise it makes. There wasn't anything big. It wasn't a real rushing tide of water. Nothing was more than about a foot tall, little water dripping over. And I just sat there and absorbed the sound. And it really, really helped. So this, this semester, as you're starting out, I encourage you to look for ways to bring the joy back to your life in the middle of this. We're still fighting COVID, we're still wearing masks, we're still waiting for vaccines, 
We're still battling kids who won't wear their mask at school. We've got kids in the building. We've got kids at home. We still have people being sent home. We are doing the absolute best we can. And everything else is out of our control. Find a way to, to look for the joy, whether that's lighting candles at home, whether that's a bubble bath, whether that's soothing music, whether that's reading a book curled up on a couch, under a blanket, whatever it is for you, find that. Go there, be there. Put the joy back in your soul this semester. That's all I got. I'll see you next week.